today's video is going to be Best of Beauty 2013. This tag I saw going around and I was like, you know, I, even though I did not do the December favorites video, I might as well just go right on ahead and just do a yearly tag. So most of these products that I'm going to show you, you probably have already seen them and you probably seen them in a couple of my favorites, my monthly favorites, but there are going to be some new products being shown too as well. So let's get started. So the first question. Primers, I've been really loving a lot of primers last year. Mainly, I have to say, I'm going to start out with the MAC Paint Pot and Paintly. I've been obsessed with I got on my cruise while I was in the Bahamas. Obsessed, love it. Then I've been obsessed with the L Primers, and this is one in sheer. The Lorac Behind the Scenes, I love it. And also NYX in the NYX Jumbo. No, excuse me, this is the NYX eyeshadow base in the jar. Absolutely love it. Yes, I love it, I love it, I love it. It's primer. Clean Clear Dual, dual Action Moisturizer. And I am obsessed with this stuff. I have to use it before I apply my foundation. And I put it on at least three to four times before I actually apply my foundation because I want my foundation to look very smooth and not cakey. And that's what it does. It helps your foundation to look smooth and not cakey and also helps prevent your acne from approaching. So that's why I really, really, really rave about and love about this product so much. Foundation. I love the Cover Girl 3 1. This is the Stay Fabulous 3 1 foundation. This stuff, I'm telling you guys, like I'm wearing it right now. It does not make me feel cakey or anything like that. So I really, really like that. As Of concealer I've been really obsessed with the red line color say blemish concealer I use it every day and I never really have a problem with it powders I've been loving the the Revlon nearly naked now Revlon nearly naked I go through these like crazy so I really go through these crazy, and I have to say, it works amazing. And it really don't, these powders, it really don't make me look ashy or anything. So any other powder I have a problem with, but when it comes down to these powders, I never really had a problem. So I use medium deep, and in the summertime, I would use a little bit of medium up under my under eyes yeah after I apply my Revlon blemish concealer but I have to say I can only use this I can only use these these are amazing okay Bron bronzer now my bronzer did kind of crack throughout the year 2013 I'm still trying to get rid of it. it is the wet wild this is the wet wild color icon and this is in the shade oh oh tickle to ticket to Brazil so I, I use ticket to Brazil and I have to say I love it and I do not want to show it because it's crumbled up and it's really cracked and it's ugly and it's just ill for blood I am obsessed when I say obsessed obsessed with the wet and wild blushes okay so the wet and wild blush these 
are been very very pigmented I love these washes never had a problem with them this one is in personal pink and I have to say these blushes are amazing very pigmented so you gotta be a little light with these blushes in a way too so kind of stay a little heavy use less of a heavier hand when it comes out to those blushes because they're very pigmented for highlighters I didn't really like highlighters in 13 I didn't even really feel the need to highlight my face in the year 2013 because I'm so used to going without applying highlighter but if it's like a really important event I definitely 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 would say I will apply it but if it's not an important event I won't apply it brows I don't have a brow routine I do not but obviously right now I am using the Mac 2 107 but I can't find a little top part because it broke so I have to go repurchase that but I was loving that brush can you watch my tutorials and stuff then you know why I love it so much shadow palette now you guys know I am and I'm obsessed with the Naked Basics by Urban Decay $27 it works amazing so um for mascara I really love the Rocket Express by Maybelline and eyeliner, I love the e.l.f. eyeliners. I have to say for lipstick. I love the e.l.f. essential lipsticks. And I've really been loving Fearless lately, the full red lip. For lip gloss, I am. I'm obsessed with Ulta's. I have it on, I have it on, but it's not near me. Ulta's lipstick and natural. This is their super shiny lip gloss and natural. And beauty subscription. I really have to say I've been loving is it's Judy's time 11 is gorgeous Juicy Star 7 all that glitters to the one of course and these for B start to finish Amy White and Marie's and Miss Glamorazzi so that was the best of beauty 2013 tag and I hope you guys enjoyed this tag and I will see you guys in my next video bye